All right, we don't have to look quite as far to find the next BYU season opener. It's in just six days at Raymond James Stadium in Tampa when the Cougars face South Florida, a game that really can't come soon enough for Kalani Sitake's squad. They wrapped up fall camp this past week with the team's third and final scrimmage, the second in a matter of four days. Full pads, full contact, blue-on-blue -blue physicality. It's hit that point in the summer where seeing some of the faces on the other side of the ball is really getting kind of old. That's one reason why Sitake is so happy game week is finally here. It's exciting. This is when it starts to get uh, really fun, you know. We're sick of playing against each other. We want to play against somebody else, and and uh, this is the right moment to end camp, and let's, let's start putting all our efforts and our energy focused on, on uh, South Florida. Paul, Nakua, Romney, Brooks, that offensive line, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, right? With all the attention BYU's offense is getting, it was the Cougars' offensive coaches that were actually quick to make sure everyone knows how good the defense is this year. They've been going against them every day since fall camp began, and they believe that it's because of the defense that BYU's offense is actually getting as much attention. Our defense, man, they're 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 really good. I'm, I'm impressed with what's going on over there, and They've made it hard for us. We know that we have a really good offense. We know that we're battling with them every single day. Nobody ever wants to say they're 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 a chump, right? Like uh, uh, we don't go out there as a defense and say, "Oh, we're facing a good offense. We're just going to bow down." I mean, it's, every day it's a battle, and and I think for our players, it's more just of just uh, personal pride, self pride, and just trying to do what we can to win games.